how to install the Diwali build of Oxygen OS 10 from the OnePlus 70 on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Diwali build of Oxygen OS 10 based on Android 10 from the OnePlus 7P on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Now, as you can see, I do have the Poco F1 and I am running MIUI 12 based on Android 10. However, even if you are on a custom ROM, the steps will still be the same. You just have to skip the steps which are not applicable to you. What are the prerequisites for this video? Well, you need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have TWRP recovery installed. How do you do that? I have separate videos for both of those which can be found in the description of the video. Next up, your device needs to be decrypted. How do you find that out? For me UI, you can go into settings, password and security, and then you'll go into privacy. For me, as you can see, encryption and credentials says phone not encrypted. Now, let us say you are on a custom ROM which is based on AOSP. In that case, you will go into settings then you'll go into security advanced and this is my pixel 3 as you can see it says in encryption and credentials that my device is encrypted so for the poco f1 to install oxygen os 10 your device needs to be decrypted how do you decrypt your poco f1 i have a separate video for that as well which can again be found in the description of this video Next thing, make sure you have a backup of all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device because if you run into any boot loops, any issues, we will have to perform a format data from TWRP in which case you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next thing you need to do is you'll go into settings, password and security and remove your password, fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done, you can go back, scroll down, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done, go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your Google account. Now, those of you who are on custom ROMs based on AOSP, you won't have the option of removing your me account. Once you have removed all the accounts and security measures, make sure you reboot your device once. We are removing all these accounts and security measures so that we do not have to log back into them when we boot back into Oxygen OS based on Android 10. Next thing, what are the files which we need now? All the files which we need are linked in the description of the video and here are the files which we need i have them in the download folder so you need the system file the vendor file the firmware file and you also need a special build of twrp by oof gang do note this is in dot img format the rest of the files are zip files i am using the firmware from 12.0.1.0 because that is the one which is recommended by the developers next thing we're going to do is we will boot into twrp so for that the first thing turn off your device once the device has turned off press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the twrp logo now once you booted into twrp we'll go into install install image now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files in case you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder if you transferred them manually you would of course know the folder where you transferred them and we're going to select the twrp oof gang image file on the next screen select recovery and then swipe to confirm flash once you get the message that image flash completed tap on the home button and we'll go into reboot and select recovery now back into twrp you will notice that the version is 3.4.0 version 7 hashtag OOF gang which means you have successfully installed the twerp recovery by OOF gang and yes you can use this build to install other custom ROMs as well and no you cannot install oxygen OS 10 on the POCO F1 without having to flash the twerp recovery by OOF gang next up wipe advanced wipe dalvik cache system vendor and data and then swipe to wipe once that is done we are going to tap on the home button go into install and now again you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files so in my case i'll go into download the first file which we need to select is the firmware file select add more zips the next file which we need to select is the vendor file add more zips and 
the third file which we need to flash is the system file and once we've selected all the three files we are going to swipe to confirm flash now once all the files are flashed successfully we can scroll up and make sure everything was in fact flashed without any issues so as you can see we are first flashing the firmware file it says patching firmware images and then script succeeded result was one next up we are flashing the vendor file and as you can see vendor was flashed successfully then it is flashing the system file and the same applies for the system file as well it was verifying the installation and then installation successful next up we will tap on the home button and no we do not have to flash disable force encryption because it is baked into one of the zip files and in this case it is going to be the vendor file now all you need to do is select reboot and then select system however in case you run into any boot loops then you will have to boot back into twrp go into wipe format data type in yes and then click on the check mark button on the bottom right of the keyboard do note that a format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device so make sure you have a backup of all those things before you perform a format data for now we are going to skip the format data part reboot and then select system and there it is you can see we have the oxygen os boot animation on our poco f1 which means our device is booting into the diwali build of oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 7d and the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick and now that we are on the home screen we can open the application drawer go into settings about phone and bam here it is you can see we are running oxygen os 10 based on android 10 the diwali build from oof gang from the oneplus 7d on our poco f1 and there it is peeps that is how you install the diwali build of oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 7d on the poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you